Good morning, good morning, Magandanu Maga, Konnichiwa, Boju. So today in this video, I'd like to talk about the gospel. And uh, I think a lot of people make it out to be a little more difficult than it actually is, but then they're also um, not taking it serious enough by um, the things that they choose to do. Now, the gospel is just another way of saying the truth. So, um, when I say that people make it more difficult than it needs to be, is uh, a lot of people get all religious about sharing their version of the gospel. And then when I say on the other end of the spectrum, people aren't taking it serious enough, the spiritual aspect, and they don't understand that their actions, what they choose to do, is completely opposite of the truth. Now, I'm really sorry if that seems... <laughs> A little confusing I will try to word it better so again the gospel is just another way of saying the truth now what most people do because most people are on that wide path to destruction most people get their gospel from sources that are not the truth I'll give you a lot of examples. My mother, who says she loves Jesus, gets her gospel truth a lot of the times from the tell lie vision. Okay? She will say phrases a lot such as, I saw it on TV. So she takes it as the gospel truth. The, whatever is said by so-called professionals or pastors on TV that they know the truth. So she's getting her gospel from the black mirror um, screen, from um, sorcery and witchcraft. I hate to say it like that, but it's the truth. So some people get their gospel truth from the internet. Again, it's from a screen, from a black mirror, sorcery and witchcraft. Some people get their gospel truth from a newspaper. They value what different um, reports say and they take it as the truth even though more likely than not it, there's no truth in it at all. Some people get their gospel truth from Bible studies with other Christians and go into different churches. And again, why does the path to destruction? The Lord isn't a liar. When he said that narrow is the gate, he means few. He, he really meant few that find the truth because few people get their truth from his Holy Spirit only. And this one's going to be a little bit controversial because I've had some people from my um, channel, even though it's very small, comment about Strong's Concordance says this or that. They're getting their gospel truth from Strong's Concordance and you're not going to find the Lord there. You're not going to get to know the Lord through Strong's Concordance. Um, Strong's Concordance was made by man. If you're breaking down words and <clears throat> examining each um, sentence, each scripture, through man's interpretation of what that word means, then you are following man. Your gospel truth is coming from man, <clears throat> not the Lord. Okay? So, 
Satan's very clever, okay, and very cunning, and is misleading most people. That's why the Lord said, test all spirits. Scripturally, it says that the Lord said, when they say the Messiah is here, believe it not. Well, Messiah means truth. When they say that the truth is here, believe it not. The truth is not outside yourself. This is spiritual. The spiritual battle is in here, in here in your temple. So where are you going to get the truth? The Holy Spirit's not outside yourself. The Holy Spirit is within when you've accepted Christ and you've become born again in Christ. So I'm not looking everywhere else outside myself for the truth. I'm looking to his Holy Spirit and humbling myself and becoming like a small child and letting go of all the indoctrination and repenting when I got my information from the internet, my gospel truth from the internet, I had to repent and turn away from that and no longer do that. When I got my gospel truth through man, I had to repent from that, turn from that and no longer do that and start over again and let it go and let the Lord lead the way. So I hope I plant a good seed I love you and God bless.